back to my channel and as you can tell by the title of this video and my outfit right now it is going to be a magical one because Disneyland has finally reopened and the magic is back in Anaheim. So as you may remember back in July of 2020 I made two park treat inspired videos to celebrate all four park reopenings in Orlando, Florida. So that's what we're making here today. We are making a Disney Park Treats Part 3 inspired by treats you can find in Disneyland and inspired by your favorite characters from Pixar Pier. I hope you're ready to make some magical treats. So with that being said, let's put on our chef's coats and let's get baking. To make the churro toffee, you'll need four sticks of unsalted butter, two cups of granulated sugar, a teaspoon of salt, and two to three bags of white chocolate melting wafers. I'm using Ghirardelli for this recipe. And for the cinnamon sugar topping, you'll need a half a cup of granulated sugar and one tablespoon of cinnamon. To get started, place parchment paper in a baking sheet or you can use a silicone baking mat like I'm using. In a large saucepan, stir your butter, sugar, and salt over medium heat until it is all melted. Stir occasionally and let it come to a boil until it turns a dark golden color. Check the temperature using a candy thermometer until it reaches 285 degrees Fahrenheit. As soon as your toffee reaches that temperature, pour it into your prepared baking sheet and let it sit for about two minutes. If you are using a silicone mold, remove the toffee from the mat and onto a cutting board and cut them there. This will make sure you do not ruin your mats. To get that Disney churro toffee look, take a plastic knife and start cutting into squares while the toffee is still soft. Go over your cutting lines at least four to five times. and then place them in the refrigerator to set for 20 minutes. Once those 20 minutes are up, it is time to start melting the chocolate. Melt the chocolate wafers either in the microwave or using the double boiler method on the stove. and dip each square into your chocolate. Sprinkle them with the cinnamon sugar mixture, then place them back onto your tray. This part is fun, but it can get messy. To all who come to this happy place, welcome. Disneyland is your land. Here age relives fond memories of the past. And here youth may savor the challenge and promise of the future. Disneyland is dedicated to the ideals, the dreams, and the hard facts that have created America. With the hope that it will be a source of joy and inspiration to all the world. Cheers. 
Let them set for another 40 minutes until the chocolate hardens and enjoy these sweet magical treats. Now let's head over to California Adventures to make Jack Jack Cookie Num Nums. To make these cookies you'll need two sticks of unsalted butter, one and a quarter cup of brown sugar, one egg and one egg yolk, a quarter cup of granulated sugar, a teaspoon of vanilla extract, a teaspoon of salt, a teaspoon of baking soda, two and one fourth cups of flour, and one cup of chocolate chips. To make these delicious cookies, preheat your oven to 350 degrees Fahrenheit. Place a small saucepan over the stove and brown the butter. Once it is done, let it cool until it begins to solidify. In a separate bowl, add in your flour, baking soda, and salt, then either sift or whisk it until it is all combined. Heading over to your electric mixer, cream the butter, brown sugar, and granulated sugar until it is light and fluffy. Next, add in the egg, egg yolk, and vanilla. Then mix it all together. Pour in your dry ingredients and mix until it is nice and smooth. Finally, it is time to add in your chocolate chips. Roll the dough into little balls and place them inside the cupcake liners. Add some chocolate chunks to the top. Then place them in the oven for about 7 to 10 minutes or until they are golden brown on the edges. Finally, place them onto a wire rack to let them cool and enjoy.
And that is it. I hope you all enjoyed the video. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up, subscribe down below, and hit that notification button so you know when the next video is. Also, while you guys are subscribing and liking the videos, send them to your friends. It's totally free to subscribe and we have a lot of fun on this channel. If any of you recreate any of the fun treats and desserts I've made on this channel, please DM me at this Instagram account to get an awesome shout out. Hope everyone is staying safe and well. For those who are going to Disneyland, have a wonderful time at the parks and everyone have a magical day.